I'm the sister of Scott Davis, and I will be reading this letter on his behalf. First, I would like to thank the court, the prosecutors, the jury, the law enforcement, and all those involved in this investigation for their time and hard work. Thank you. I would like to express my condolences to the family of David, Ralph, and Tim. It was only by the grace of God that I survived. Brogan, you took the lives and dreams from the men. that you and your mentor killed for nothing more than a few possessions that meant nothing to you, but to those men and their families, it was part of their lives and it meant something to them. You took from me a chance to have a normal life. This jury has served justice. Taking your dreams and freedom away from you is nothing compared to what you have taken from David, Ralph, Tim, and I. I sincerely hope that every day for the rest of your life that you think about what you have done, what you have taken from, taken, and about the families whose lives you have destroyed. You dug a grave knowing that your mentor and yourself was putting a body in it the following day. You sat down across from me and ate your meal knowing what fate awaited me. You had every chance to stop what was about to happen. You chose not to. You really are a cold-hearted and sick person with no regard of human life. I hope that someday you will see what you have done and be able to give a sincere apology to the families whose lives you have destroyed. I understand you read the Bible. Another judgment is coming. I hope that you are prepared for the judgment of God. Scott. And that is from my brother.